drop the 91 plus Encore Hero pick. We also have some Knockout Path to Glory Duo store packs to open. Let's open some and see what we get. If you guys are looking for cheap, fast, and reliable Ultimate Team coins, check out MMOEXP.com. Link in the description. Save 5% using code HABER. I can't lie to you. I don't know about anyone, anyone else watching this video, but I personally don't really care about heroes at this stage of the game. Um, there's like three heroes I'd care about, and I've already got one of them in my team. That's Tether, so... We'll open it anyway. We'll, we'll see what we get. We got ourselves a Fantasy Schneider or a Galazzo Janola. Annoyingly, like a month ago, I would be like jumping around because they're, they're both like class, right? But at this stage of the game, it's like... I don't know. Do I care? I mean, Janola's still all right. I don't really know. <laughs> Is Janola good anymore? He's still 400k, to be fair. What about Schneider? I'm surprised that both of these cards haven't had better versions. Schneider's 440. They're both all right. Who do I even take here? I'm going to take I'm gonna take Janola. Screw it. I mean, I think that could have gone worse. All right, next one. Who we got? We got ourselves Fantasy Kiesler. Couldn't have even got the greatest of the game, Kiesler, could we? Well, you know what? I mean, that could have been a lot worse. I'll take Janola, actually. That could have gone a lot worse. Guaranteed Path to Glory knockouts pack. We've got ourselves a Uruguayan right winger for Kondo Palistri. Let's go. Nice. Obviously, Uruguay won yesterday against Brazil. And we also... Oh, wow. That's sick. Oh, my word. That's a really good one. Oh, my God. That's incredible. No? No. John Stone's 1.5 million, 97 rated. Oh my word. What a pack, by the way. Wow. So he's going to get either a 98 or a 5 star, 5 star when we beat the Netherlands. And then when we win the Euros, he's going to be like 98 or 99 rated. Oh my word. Wow. That is incredible. I was not expecting that. I'm not going to lie. I was not expecting that. That's incredible. Wow. Get in there. All right. We've got a duo guarantee now. Let's see who we get. We've got a Spanish right back. Is that Danny Carvajal? No. It's Jesus Navas. What rating is he? 96. Danny Olmo, who I already have, but he cooked, to be fair, against Germany. He was great against Germany. I already have him, unfortunately. So it's only 97 rated fodder, which is crazy high fodder. We've got the Celso as well. Wow. Okay. I mean, this card looks good. 96 rated right back. We get La Celso, who's like one of the better ones of this whole, like this week. I'll take that. That's solid. We also got Jimenez and Endoy as well. Nice. That is a, I'd, I'd say that's pretty decent, to be fair. All right, 84 times 10. Best of Nations pack. Come on, EA. No special card from the Best of Nations pack. We got ourselves a German centre mid. Is it Tony Cruz? It is not Tony Cruz. It's good, the one. It's going to be a double walkout. Let's go. Double walkout in July. Wow. All right. Knockouts guarantee on the second account now. Let's see what we have. We have ourselves an English striker. Is that Ollie Watkins? Ollie Watkins is the first player. It's not a bad card, to be fair. 96 rated. That card looks nice. I've not used it, but he definitely looks like a card I want to try out. And who else we got there? Pedri. Apparently, Pedri is like the most common card in this game, by the way. Like, everyone seems to have packed this Pedri card. I thought I was special on Friday, but I mean, I am special, but not in that way. Uh, we get ourselves Pedri and Ollie Watkins, though. 96 and 98 rated. Rodriguez, Lippmann in there as well. Borja and Doi. How much are these cards? Watkins, like 140k. Pedri's still expensive, to be fair. He's still, like, over 500k, I think. But apparently just, like, super common. We'll take it. All right, duo guarantee time now. We've actually got ourselves a Copper America card. We've got ourselves a 96 Jesus Navas. It's going to be, like, the Celso or someone like that. Ooh... Rodrigo de Paul. Wow. 98 Rodrigo de Paul, you know. Damn. Ferran Torres in there as well, who I guess is also pretty common because we packed him on both accounts now as well. Wow. What a card. This probably becomes 99 rated as well. Let's be honest with ourselves. I mean, Canada have actually impressed me in this Copper America. Um, shout out to Bombiso and Cornelius. I mean, that, that, that duo at the back. I mean, sheesh. I will take it though. Hopefully it becomes a 99 rated card. Nice. That is solid. All right. On to my second account now. We've got the two icon picks from last week that we just saved. 
Um, and then we've got the hero picks as well. So, icon picks first. Let's see what we get. Raul. Raul. We'll take a 93 Raul. Who else we got? Come on. Grace of the game? We did get a Grace of the game. Sadly, I've already got him. I'm going to take Laurent Blanc. All right. Hero time. Let's see what the hero pick is going to give out. First one. We've got ourselves a Galazzo Rezitsky. Oh, oh. Nice. Thanks, EA. Let's go. Big dubs. We get a McManaman. At least it is a Grace of the game. First one we've seen all of these picks. Not amazing, but 94 rated. Um, about 30k. Let's go. All right. Here we go again. One icon pick and then two hero picks. Let's see what we get. All right. First one's going to be... Ooh. 96 Forelands. Not bad, actually, to be fair. I do miss when heroes were a bit more exciting than this, to be fair. He's only 200k. I know heroes last year were a little bit more exciting because of the chemistry. But now icons give chemistry. It doesn't really give heroes much of a, a standout. We get Keesley there as well. 94. So at least you got two... Gala uh, sorry. Greats of the game heroes. But it is a bit of a shame, really. It's like... Oh, he's taking Keen. Fair enough. All right. Fair play. All right. Here we go with the icon. Come on, EA. Give us like a Rivaldo or a Dalgleish. Stoichkov? It's not bad. Could have been better. Could have been worse. It's not bad, though. I don't know. I just feel like EA needs to revamp heroes. Because if we get into this stage of the game and people just do not care about heroes at all, I understand that heroes can't really be better than icons because EA have kind of made them this like less cool card i don't really know but like they've got to do something surely yeah they've got to make them better than what they are because heroes becoming boring by about february is just not it you can't keep having heroes just die out in february like it's just not good for the game is it anyway that's just my thought process i know they don't technically die out you know you, you still got the likes of janola and yayatora that get good cards past february but i just feel like any hero pick and pack we've had in the last six months nobody's cared about which is a bit sad. Uh, anyway, at least he got Kotchu in his 86 double. He's 84 times 10 best of nations pack now. Ooh, copper card. Here we go. It's going to be Brasil. What we got? We got Edison, who might be off the Saudi. But the actual special card is going to be Wendell, 94. I mean, very worse. It's exchanger. It's a bit of fodder. You take that. Can't complain too much. All right, time for Ruben now. He's got his 83 times 20 and 84 times 20 as well as the hero pick. Ooh, Carvalho is not bad. I feel like Cavalier is all right. This card, it's a shame that he won't get upgrades. Um, but I really like CBs that have got Anticipate and Aerial Plus. I feel like they are a lot better than most other CBs that I've used. And maybe it's because I'm really bad at the game and re really rely on Anticipate Plus and Aerial Plus to defend. But you know what? I'm, I'll own that. I'll, I'll accept it. It's fine. All right. 83 times 20. Come on, EA. Give us a path to glory. Or not. We get ourselves a gold card in July. We're not getting Path of Glories in 83 times 20s. Whew, pain. All right. Well, store that in the club. Seven dupes. They're all 84 or less. Discard those, all of them. All right. Come on. 84 times 20. Be better. We want to see Path of Glory cards. We want to see that green and red. Please. Or blue and red. Blue and red's fine. Blue and red's okay. We get ourselves Spanish CB. It's going to be like Mapillon or, or Irene Paredes. Who is going to be the card though? Jimenez. It's 94. Could go even higher. It depends if they beat Colombia. Um, at least it's a special card. All right, next hero pick. It's just July 7th, by the way, guys. It's July 7th. And we're packing 92 rate heroes at July 7th. All right, Zalem's 91 plus hero picks next on the Xbox. Let's see what Zalem is going to get. First one. Yeah, yeah, Torre Fantasy. I feel like that's a fun card to collect. It's not really that usable anymore, but it's a fun card to collect, I guess. All right, next one. That's unfortunate. That is very unfortunate. All right, we're doing the guarantee pack in the store. Wait, who is... Oh, okay. All right, that makes sense. Hero Lipmanen. I was very confused then. Who's that? Ooh. Ooh, that's not great at all. That's not great at all. That's not great at all. The guarantee, the guarantee knockout pack did not pay out today. That is, uh, ooh, 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 that's not great. Wait, you actually got one in the nano pack? No way. You got Lee Watkins in the nano pack? No, you didn't. You got Harry Kane. He actually got one in the nano pack. That's crazy. 100 points and he's got, he's got one in the nano pack. If this is someone good now, that'd be hilarious. 
I can't. I don't know who that is. Endoy. He hasn't got a player face, so I didn't know who that was. Fair enough, though. For a, for a nano pack, that's solid. Right, another knockout guarantee pack. He's got a Copper America card. Well, two Copper America cards here. He's got himself a Yankel Herrera. Will he get like an Enemila Tower or someone crazy like that? Let's find out. Who is going to be the Copper America Path to Glory knockout card? Will it be another DePaul? Borja. I mean, that card doesn't look bad, to be fair. 99 rated, but... You've got Messi. You've got the Panenka King himself, Messi. But aside from that, not great. Hello, we have a Copper America card here. Portugal, Cam, Bruno Fernandes, who is going to be the Copper America card. Go on, be like a DePaul. It's going to be another Borja. 95, though. You can't complain about 95 Borja. Borja. Borja Iglesias. Sorry. All right. And then the third and final 86 double is going to be nothing. Here we go. Copper card. French goalkeeper, Mike Mignon. He's had a great Copper tournament, hasn't he? Eh, eh, eh. Who is it going to be? Is it going to be someone good? Or is it going to be another Borja slash Vendel slash Yangel Herrera? No, it's Facundo. Go on, Facundo. Love that. Absolutely love that. Big Facundo Pilistri. Love him. Absolutely love him. Glad to see that he's doing well for uh, for Uruguay as well. Next 86 double. No special card, unfortunately. Would have been nice if we had a special card there. Cobell and Lataro Martinez. Third and final one. Come on, EA. Pay out. No, fair enough. Hello? Hello? What we got? Wait, what have we actually got here? Bernardo Silva? He was a... Yeah, he, he did get Path to Glory, but it wasn't Impact, was it? Who's this? Wendell. We'll take that. That's at least a, just an exchanger, isn't it? Nice. Two exchanges. We'll take that. That's always solid. Oh, we get back-to-back -back copper cards in uh, in these packs. We got Rolfo. We got Rolfo and who? Who is this? These A6 doubles are paying out for me. Who is that? Yangel Herrera. Nice. We'll take that. That's solid. That's solid. 